We'll learn today about the world of the unseen, the Jinn. Created from smokeless fire, Jinn are a powerful yet elusive part of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's creation. They have existed long before humans, and they also have free will. We share the same purpose so that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala stated in the Quran, I have not created the jinn and the humans except to worship me. There are good and evil ones among them, male and female, believers and non-believers. They eat, they drink, they have homes, they have families, they have religions. Three types of jinn we know of and Allah knows best. First type is the type that flies. They have a special power that enables them to fly and to go very fast to places. Second type of jinn are the jinns that have the ability to take shapes. Shape of humans, animals and different beings. The third types of jinns are the jinns that resides and lives with us, and they move in and out. In the Quran Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, He created them from the purest form of fire, and where there is no smoke, no ash flying around. Are jinns dangerous? Are jinns the reason for possession? What's the difference between them? How to protect yourself from the evil jinns? Tell me in the comment section what do you think and I will address in subsequent videos insha'Allah.